guys hair and I have my hair in this amazing lovely luscious twist um, I can probably start by untwisting these and showing you guys my beautiful twist out um, these were done on dry hair I added a little Alekin natural 17 oil which is one of my faves as well as elastic QP's leave-in conditioner elastic QP is not an all-natural product but it is amazing and it does not leave your hair dry it leaves your hair very moisturized it lasts me the moisture from that lasts me about five days and then i re-moisture re-wet and then add a little more cream and oil and i go about my business so let me go ahead and i'm gonna unravel these so you guys can see my awesome awesome twist out that i've got here You see this twist up? Like popping. Come on, come on down. It's a detained show. I'm just fucking with y'all. Hey y'all. I am detained and I'm here with my very first untamed main vlog. I'm so excited. You guys don't even self know how long I've been wanting to do this channel long okay very very long Ugh. i just um never had the confidence to i've always been really really quiet um some people would say that i'm stuck up i'm really not don't don't even self believe all of that mess um really cool down to earth um i like to get i would like to get to know more people but I've always been shy, so getting to know people was not really my thing. Um, I've always been stuck to my shell and kept to myself, which now that I'm getting older, I'm realizing like it's a lonely world out there. I don't want to be like this no more. <laughs> so I'm trying to learn how to be more outgoing. Um, it's very tough. It's very hard for me, but I'm definitely willing to learn if anybody has any tips. Um, definitely let me know. DM me. Hello, and um, this is going to be my natural hair vlog. If you know me personally, you know I've been natural for a very long time. I have a head full of natural, thick, beautiful, luscious hair. Let me stop just boosting myself up like that. You think I'm calm though, okay? Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, I've been wanting to always do a natural hair vlog. I just never really had the confidence to. Um, and now that I want to come out of my shell a little bit more, I feel like I can definitely do that through hair. Um, so if you have any questions, um, I have met a lot of people that have complimented me on my hair and asked me questions on how I, how you the deal with your hair, your hair so thick, oh my gosh, I want to go natural, but I don't know, it's too much work. It's really not that much work, it's pretty easy, um, once you get to learning what works for your hair then it's it's easy um i have thick hair so come on it's not that hard um it's a lot. if you have patience you'll be good like no worries everything gonna be straight everything going you know um if you're afraid of a little shrinkage then you're gonna have a problem because with natural hair it definitely tends to shrink up um i did a big chop my second big chop last year in august august 15 2018 to be exact i did a big chop i cut all my hair off because i had dyed it and bleached it colored it i wasn't taking care of it it started to fall off like piano pieces and i just wasn't having it so i cut it all off and i started over again and now this is where i'm at So definitely, definitely getting back to where it used to be before it was like almost brushed up, past brushed up, like it was long. Um, so that's my main goal to go past that where it was. 
um, and I'm gonna do that through protective styling if you want to go natural but you're afraid to I would recommend transitioning if you don't want to transition transition is a stage where you just let your natural hair your kinky hair grow up and then you gradually cut off the straight ends I always recommend people to just go ahead and chop it all off faster that way me personally that's what I think um, but if, you, if you're afraid of that 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 stage where you don't know what to do with your hair and it's like so short and oh my god I look like a dude it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay I've been there done that twice and the first time around to be honest my hair took a lot longer to grow than this time around this time around it took about three years to get to this like the first time around and this time around it took me within a year to get to this length. So I can't even I can't wait to see how long it's gonna be next year, August. And definitely I will do a video on that. Um but for me what works is low manipulation. I learned this throughout my pregnancy. People thought that it was my pregnancy that grew my hair. No. It was the fact that I wasn't playing in my hair as much. If you know me, if you worked with me, if you just knew me on a one-to-one -one or whatever you want to call it you would know that i had a different hairstyle for work every day a different hairstyle i never came to work with the same hairstyle maybe twice but not three times in a row i had a different hairstyle every week um so me playing my hair every day doing a different style that did not work for my hair and then i was on this thing where um co-washing every weekend that didn't work for me neither i don't call me nasty, but to be honest, I wash my hair like every four months. I don't wash it often because I don't put no heap of products in my hair as I used to back in the days when I had first started my journey. Right now, I have my main products that I stick to. I would do a video on that. And those are my go-tos. Those are the only ones that I work with and I know how they work with my hair. So there's not much buildup or anything for me to wash out. It's just a product. I just keep rewetting my hair and keep going. Um, uh, yeah, a lot of people thought that it was my pregnancy that grew my hair. Maybe it had a part to play in it, but the whole, nah, I don't think it did it for my hair. I think it was me not combing my hair because to prove myself, I went ahead and I chopped it off when it started to fall off and just to see how much it has grown already I definitely know that no manipulation works for my hair um, when I had my son I thought oh he's nice son. so he's like I'm gonna save like mine negative so for his whole first year I barely used to comb his hair all I would do is moisturize it, brush it a little bit, and let him go about his business. No, it took, I was like, why are you up here? I'm growing. I'm like, come on, mommy has so much hair, you got no hair. Um, what worked for his hair is when he finally went to daycare and I started to comb his hair every week, more often, his hair started to grow. And I was like, okay, so my hair works when I don't play in it, and your hair works when I play in it. I don't get it. Whose child are you for? Yeah, so you definitely have to pay attention to what works for your hair. Um, it takes time and it takes a lot of money. So if you're willing to spend the money, then go ahead, shoot for it. Let's do this journey. I'm willing to give you advice if you want any advice. Um, if you want to know what products would work for your hair. Sometimes I could look at people's hair and I could tell maybe this hair could work you can try this and I could definitely give you advice and let you know like you know what to do I've successfully made my sisters my mom yeah all my sisters are mom but not just because of what <laughs> and I'm super happy about that um kudos to me so yeah um natural hair is really beautiful on its own don't let anybody ever tell you wrong to be honest um my journey has been my journey has been good to me definitely i've tried so many products i'll definitely make a video for you guys and let you know what products i've tried which ones worked which ones didn't so stay tuned for that video because it's coming soon i hope you guys like it i hope you guys like this video um, 
definitely will be back with more so stay tuned and let me know what you guys think comment like subscribe dm me whatever you want to do just let me know what you think what i can work on this is my first one don't be too hard on me please follow me on instagram at i wrong one Follow me on Instagram at Untamed Main. I'm going to put it somewhere in this video so you guys can 